Hello everyone, welcome back to another Ridgeside episode. Oh, we got the quest for getting down to 25 levels deep from QI. Well, we already did that, so I think we have to do it again and then we'll get like 10k or something, which is good. That will be very nice. A good chunk of change so we can spend it on something else. Why did we need Iridium bars? Oh my gosh, the sprinklers, of course. <laughs> I was like, there's something we need Iridium bars for, right? But yeah, it's the sprinklers. What else do we need? <gasps> oh, just gold, Iridium and battery packs. So we're gonna make four of these, I think. Maybe I only need three. I'll start with three and I'll save the other Iridium bar. Yeah, because I wanted them to go on these plots of crops here. So I think three is enough. I will quickly water these as well. I'm so glad we got all that Iridium because watering all of these crops would have been pretty unfortunate to be fair. <laughs> but now we don't need to water them anymore. Okay, they're all watered. I feel like it still used a lot of my time. I think I'm just pretty slow at doing that. We also have six quality sprinklers in here. Do I not need those for anything? Do we not have another crop field? I thought we had more crops. Oh no, we actually don't. We just have the beans. I wonder if I should buy some more maybe. Also, I wonder if the stuff in our shed is done. Let me have a check. Yay, we have some wines to sell. That's really good actually, because we do need some monies. All of these kegs are empty right now though, because I don't think we have many crops. So we are waiting on some crops to be done. Okay, I'm gonna quickly do the animals and then I'll probably head up to Ridgeside because I really do wanna go and check out the hotel expansion that we got in the last episode, cause that is pretty exciting. It's so nice to see all the animals outside again after winter, but I do think I should get some grass starters maybe so that I can put them in here. It's kinda sad without grass. It's also such a small area for these poor barn animals. I feel so bad cause the chickens have masses of space. But this is all they get for now, unfortunately. Okay, I've bought some gifts and I'm going to quickly run over to Pierre's to sell the wines and stuff. So let's do that real quick. Just in case there's really cool stuff to buy. Oh, and Ian's here. Hi, Ian. When I help out at the library, I sometimes get to see the classes Penny teaches to the children. She's real smart. Oh, he'd be so cute with Penny, actually. I wish there was a way you could, like, set people up with each other. That would be really cool, especially if, like, you have no intention of dating them. It would be really cool to see them date. And then, like, it would be really cool if you could watch the, like, 10 and 14 heart events, but it's them two instead of you being in it. That would be so cool. Because, like, I want to see Ian's 14 heart event, but I don't really want to romance him, you know? But it would be really cool if you could do that and you could set them up. Oh, I wish that was a thing. I'd like to sit in sometime, but I'm kind of embarrassed. Oh, yeah, because he wanted help with his right right oh that would be so sweet if she could give him some tutoring or something oh you shouldn't be embarrassed ian oh my god it's closed on wednesdays of course it is oops i forgot about that it's because we still haven't completed the community center have we what are we waiting for actually i think it's like a load of fish and stuff oh maybe i can get some of the fish already in spring i should probably pay attention to that what fish are we still missing let's see like there's some fish i'm pretty sure i can get in spring catfish i think i can if it's raining the eel i can definitely get but i think it has to be raining potentially and tilapia i think is summer and then bulletin board we need a truffle which i don't think we even have a pig yet <laughs> and the rabbit's foot we're still waiting on too okay i think that's all we have though so there is a couple things we could be working on in spring for the community center but there's not tons i'll definitely look out for fish on rainy days though but for now i'd quite like to go and see the hotel okay let's see what's going on in here then is there anything new oh Okay, she's got her own desk here. <gasps> what? Would you like to reserve an event birthday party? For who though? Oh my god, can you throw birthday parties for villagers? Wait, is there anyone with a birthday coming up? There's Kent. I'd rather do Alyssa's. I wonder if I have to do it on the day. Should I just try it? I don't know. It would have been cool to do for torts though. Is there anything else going on? <gasps> oh my gosh, is this the cafe? Hello? Look at this. Wow. Oh, whoa, Clementine cake, crunchy bagel. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff. That's so cool. Oh, the bagels look nice. And what's this? Recipes available during weekends? Oh, stop right now. That's so cool. What about back here? Oh, wow. Okay, so it's like a big empty room. I'm guessing it gets decorated if you have a birthday here or something. That's cool. Oh, I want to do it. No reserved events. Okay, I kind of want to try it. Shall we try? Let's reserve an event for a birthday party. Let's just do it. Would you like to reserve an event? Yes, I'd like to throw a party for 1,500. Ah, <gasps> look. 
That's so cool, Kent, Lewis or Alyssa. Let's throw one for Alyssa. Thank you. Come visit the event hall anytime on the celebrant's birthday. We hope to see you soon. Oh my gosh, I think that will be next episode then because we usually play like two days and Alyssa's will be at the start of next episode. So that is something really cool to look forward to then. Oh my gosh, I wonder what will happen. Oh, I kind of feel bad it wasn't floor first. Never mind, I'm sure Floor won't mind, right? Oh, I forgot that I needed to bring Kayahi a bomb. Uh, Freddy wants their sword. Okay, we found that once, so we can go and get that again. I think it was down south. And I also want to see if I'm able to sell my wine and stuff at the farm shop. Let's see if that's possible. Ooh, we got an amethyst from that bin. Nice. Oh, Bryle's here. Lewis and Lenny have a fun sibling relationship. Oh, you can't actually friend Bryle, by the way. I don't think you can gift him. He hasn't got like a friendship thingy. Sometimes Lenny seems to take it too far though, and I can see the old man fuming. I bet you enjoy that, don't you? You mean, mean man. I was hanging out at the lady's office the other day. That's how I saw their exchange. Good chatting with you, I guess. <laughs> I'm not really sold on him right now. Okay, oh, I can't sell to Jerick. That sucks. I can buy from Jerick, and his stuff is sometimes a lot cheaper, I think. So I might actually just buy everything. I think it might be worth it. So yeah, I think it's cheaper here, right? I can't tell. I can't remember the original prices. I wish I could. I'm just going to buy everything. I wish he sold eight of everything so it could have gone nicely around sprinklers, but oh well, we bought six of each. Thanks, Jerick. And I also wanted to run to Kimpoy's shop as well because he's got new stock apparently. So let's go and do that quickly. Hi, Torts. It's our new best friend. Oh, I should have bought him a gift. I always forget. Okay, let's see what Kimpoy's selling then. Hi, Kimpoy. Ooh, the Ember Blood Lime Sapling. Hello. I don't think I've seen that before. And maybe the Desert Tangelo Sapling. I think that might be new too. Whoa, they're cool. Okay, we've definitely gotten the Northern Lime Quart and the Mountain Plum Quart saplings i think do we also have the cherry pluer i think maybe so we are still missing a couple of them but eventually i want to have all these trees i think that'll be really cool we can't unfortunately afford any right now though <laughs> i've spent too much money today my spending habits in this game are just so bad <laughs> oh alice is down here i'm pretty sure one of these flowers are one of her favorites so i'm gonna check quickly yeah it's the irises she loves them Oh, we already have max hearts with Alyssa, by the way. Let's give her an iris. I love this. Thank you so much, Lil. Yeah, we already have max hearts with her, but it's still nice to gift her, you know. She's such a cutie pie. I sometimes see the old couple who live just north of my farm spend time around the second waterfall. How does she not know them yet? I want what they have someday. Oh, she thinks of Lola and Freddy as being like the girls. I think of them that way too. I can't lie. What about you, Lil? Would you like to have a family with someone someday? I mean, yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't mind it. She's so sweet. I really do like Alyssa. Okay, here's Freddy's sword. And I may as well pop down here as well and see if there's anything to harvest. There is. <gasps> this looks new. A fox bloom? I haven't seen that before. That's really cool. What does it say about it? A mythical flower only thought to exist in legends. It seems to give off an otherworldly aura. <gasps> does it say it sells for 11,000? Is that correct? What? 11,000 gold. Okay, we're gonna try selling that tonight and see if that's real or not because that seems way too much for a flower. It must be loved by so many people, right? Whoa, it must be really rare. Okay, I'm gonna give some little quick flowers and stuff just to people around here. Oh, oh yeah, Freddy's sword, of course. There you are, old friend. Thank you, Lil. No worries, Freddy. And I'll do some more gifts to everyone just to get some little hearts up and such. Oh my god, it's gonna be so hard to get everyone's friendship up if we were to try and do perfection. It will be so difficult. <laughs> okay, I've given so many flowers. Basically, all the forage I just got, I've given away. So I think that is our job done for today. There's so many people in Ridgeside. <laughs> like, it just keeps multiplying, I swear. But yeah, I'm gonna head back home now. I think we might need to do some mining tomorrow. Oh, we can talk to Yuma quickly. I really want to befriend Yuma. I'll give him some cheese, I guess. Oh no. <gasps> I'm telling my brother. You're rude. He hates cheese. Why do you hate cheese, Yuma? That's very sad. That's very sad. <laughs> Oh, we got some money from Freddy's request. Okay, nice. We also have the geodes to do. And we only have 12 days to do this in. So I think we might dedicate tomorrow to trying to get some of the geodes. I think that'll be a good idea. Oh, I never get over how pretty this looks. It looks so stunning. 
And let me sell all the stuff we didn't want to keep as well. And I'm definitely going to sell this fox bloom and see how much money we get from it. I hope it's a lot. That would be so cool. I also have all these seeds to plant as well. So let's do that quickly. And we've got the spare sprinklers in here too. Okay, this looks a little bit of a mess with how I've planted everything. At least it's planted now. And hopefully this should give us a fair bit of money. Okay, we've got a bunch of stuff down. I might check our cave as well. Oh, we got loads in here. Grab all of this. And yeah, tomorrow is definitely going to be mine's day to try and get geodes. I wonder what floors are best for geodes. I might quickly check that out. Okay, according to Stargy Wiki, the mines is the best place to get them from, of course. You can get them from fishing chests too. But floors 1 to 39 are best and also from duggies. So I think we'll probably just reset like the top floors and try and get a lot of duggies and stuff. And see how many geodes we can get. I think we should hopefully be able to do it, but who knows. <laughs> I do often get a lot of confidence and then fail so we'll try but we don't know I'll put on some more bars as well it's good to keep them topped up I feel oh and since this is looking really dark I might add a bunch of torches around the farm because we actually have loads sitting in this chest so I might grab these quickly so I'm gonna grab these and just place them on the edges of the fences because it's looking real dark around here and i also just want to make some more fencing for down here too because i did say i wanted to do that with the stone fence we don't have loads of time now because it's already gone midnight but can quickly throw a bit of stone fencing down okay nice i think this looks pretty cute and tomorrow we will do some mining oh my gosh how much did we make it really did sell for eleven thousand. that's wild that is so much money oh my gosh eleven thousand for this one flower it must be really rare maybe i shouldn't have sold my first fox bloom but hello <laughs> that's so much money hopefully we get more of those then and it's kent's birthday but we don't really befriend vanilla characters so we'll probably leave that and we have some mail <gasps> oh my gosh we got ten thousand. hello oh yeah of course because we did the we did the quest already nice thanks qi I did wonder if we'd get it straight away because we'd already done it, you know? I'm glad we did. I wonder if we should do our final barn upgrade now then. We just need stone and wood for that, right? I believe so. I'm going to go and check in at Robin's how much it is and we'll see if we can afford it. But right now we're going to run off to the mines as well. Maybe we do already have the barn upgrade because isn't the auto feeder part of the barn upgrade? Maybe we can already buy pigs. I might run down to Marnie's and see, because that would be really nice. Then we could save for a house upgrade instead. I think we do need to fill up our silos again though, because we have run out of food there, unfortunately. Okay, let's run down to Marnie's and see. Can we buy a pig? We can! Okay, I didn't even know we had that already. We should definitely buy a pig. We do need the truffle still, so let's buy ourselves a little pig. Oh my gosh, that's basically my name. Lilla? My name's Lily. <laughs> That's basically my name. That must be fate. I'm going to go for Lila. It's so cute. Or Lila, however you want to pronounce it. It's basically my name though. So let's go for Lila the little piglet. Thank you, Marnie. Okay, we bought ourselves a little piggy. And now I'm going to run up to the mine. So we didn't need to bring our wood and our stone because we've already done the barn upgrade. But that is our first little piglet. And we should now be able to get the truffle by the end of spring for sure. I think it takes like 10 days for them to age up, right? I do need to also scythe some hay tonight. I can't forget to do that because they are angie. So I just checked on the Stargy wiki again and the next house upgrade I think for us will be the 50,000 and 150 hardwood. So we might start collecting that hardwood pretty soon and we're still a ways off from 50k but it's something to set our minds to, you know? Okay, let us begin. Let's try and get as many geodes as possible. I'm just like breaking rock. I don't really know the best strat for this. It'd probably be best to like reset sandy floors maybe. But we've already gotten two, so this isn't awful, you know? I guess geodes are quite common. I still don't have a glow ring in this save. What on earth? <laughs> How have I been going this long without a glow ring? Usually there are duggies on these floors. Oh my gosh, there's none today. Where are all the duggies at? I'm actually trying to seek them out right now. <laughs> okay, there's got to be some duggies on this floor, right? There always is. Always, come on. Where are the duggies? Literally zero. That makes no sense. There's always duggies on there. Okay, so it's just gone midnight. We didn't get the most amount of geodes. We got nine. So I still think it's doable like to get 30 in 12 days or so. But it did take me a lot of grinding, I won't lie. <laughs> Let's head off to sleep now that we sold all of those things. 
We leveled up in mining. Nice. We got the crystallarium. That's good. We should craft a bunch of those. I think we have enough batteries to do so. So that might be worth crafting a couple of those. Especially since we're romancing floor, we should definitely have some rubies in there. <laughs> and we didn't make too much money, but that's okay. Day five of spring. Oh my gosh. And it's Alyssa's birthday today, right? <gasps> you reserved a birthday party for Alyssa today. That's so cool. We'll have to find out what that's all about in the next episode. I think this will probably be a pretty short episode. So I'm sorry about that, but hopefully I'll make it up to you with maybe a slightly longer one. But thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this short and sweet episode and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye, everyone.